111. For each of the following statements, select yes if the statement is true. Otherwise, select no. Note, each correct selection is worth one point. The text analytics service can identify in which language text is written. Yes. The text analytics service can detect handwritten signatures in a document. No. The text analytics service can identify companies and organizations mentioned in a document. Yes. The Text Analytics API is a cloud-based service that provides advanced natural language processing over raw text and includes four main functions, sentiment analysis, key phrase extraction, named entity recognition, and language detection. One hundred and twelve. Match the types of natural languages processing workloads to the appropriate scenarios. To answer, drag the appropriate workload type from the column on the left to its scenario on the right. Each workload type may be used once, more than once, or not at all. Note, each correct selection is worth one point. Select and place. Workloads types. Entity recognition. Key phrase extraction. Language modeling. Sentiment analysis. Translation. Speech recognition and speech synthesis. Entity recognition extracts persons, locations, and organizations from the text. Sentiment analysis evaluates text along a positive-negative scale. Translation converts text to a different language. 113. For each of the following statements, select yes if the statement is true. Otherwise, select no. Note, each correct selection is worth one point. Monitoring online service reviews for profanities is an example of natural language processing. Yes. Identifying brand logos in an image is an example of natural. Languages processing. No. Monitoring public news sites for negative mentions of a product. Is an example of natural language processing. Yes. One hundred and fourteen. You are developing a natural language processing solution in Azure. The solution will analyze customer reviews and determine how positive or negative each review is. This is an example of which type of natural language processing workload? A. Language detection. B. Sentiment analysis. C. Key phrase extraction. D. Entity recognition. Answers, B. Sentiment analysis is the process of determining whether a piece of writing is positive, negative, or neutral. 115. You use natural language processing to process text from a Microsoft News story. You receive the output shown in the following exhibit. Which type of natural languages? Processing was performed? A. Entity recognition. B. Key phrase extraction. C. Sentiment analysis. D. Translation. Answers, A. Named entity recognition, NER, is the ability to identify different entities in text and categorize them into predefined classes or types such as person, location, event, product, and organization. In this question, the square brackets indicate the entities such as date-time, 
Person type, skill. You use natural language processing to process text from a Microsoft news story. One hundred and sixteen. You plan to apply text analytics API features to a technical support ticketing system. Match the text analytics API features to the appropriate natural language processing scenarios. To answer, drag the appropriate feature from the column on the left to its scenario on the right. Each feature may be used once, more than once, or not at all. Note: each correct selection is worth one point. Select and place. API features, entity recognition, key phrase extraction, detection, sentiment analysis. Sentiment analysis understand how upset a customer is based on the text contained in the support ticket. Key phrase extraction summarize important information from the support ticket. Entity recognition extract key dates from the support ticket. One hundred and seventeen. You are authoring a language understanding, Luis, application to support a music festival. You want users to be able to ask questions about scheduled shows, such as which act is playing on the main stage. The question which act is playing on the main stage is an example of which type of element. A an intent. B an utterance. C a domain. D an entity. Correct answer B. Utterances are input from the user that your app needs to interpret. One hundred and eighteen. You build a Q and A maker bot by using a frequently asked questions FAQ page. You need to add professional greetings and other responses to make the bot more user friendly. What should you do? A increase the confidence threshold of responses. B enable active learning. C create multi-turn questions. D add chit chat. One hundred and nineteen. You need to develop a chatbot for a website. The chatbot must answer users' questions based on the information in the following documents: a product troubleshooting guide in a Microsoft Word document, a frequently asked questions FAQ list on a web page. Which service should you use to process the documents? A. Azure Bot Service. B. Language Understanding. C text analytics. D Q and A maker. One hundred and twenty. You are building a language understanding model for an e-commerce business. You need to ensure that the model detects when utterances are outside the intended scope of the model. What should you do? A. Test the model by using new utterances. B. Add utterances to the none intent. C. Create a pre-built task entity. D. Create a new model. Answers B. The none intent is filled with utterances that are outside of your domain.